And here we have what who I call Honest John. Honest John, you went with me to the auction. What do you think about it? I loved it. It was great. I did really well. And you know, in the future, we're going to look and see some how good he did. But I'm looking for this coming week and some more. Ah, uh, but today we're going to look yeah, at what I'm, 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 I found. So I did. What I did. A, well, you, let's find out. Let's find out. Yes. Yeah, yes. Let's find, out, let's, let's find it. out. Let's find out. Okay, folks, there's 118. This is the locker we won. Let's see how we do here. Got the combination off. And there was one thing in there I wanted right away. Here it goes. The suspense is killing me. Hey, it's uh, this is a little dark spot. We got a little beer can there. I didn't realize it was so dark in here. Anyway, I'll have to turn the light on. That's what uh, John was talking about, that big pot. I might be trading that with him. This is what I, when I saw this microwave, I said, oh, yeah. That's going to be good and everything because uh, we need one from a personal level. So let's take a look. Let's see if I can get the lights on here and see what we got. Okay, that's a little bit better. We're going to have to... Take a while to get all this out, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and figure out what we got. A door panel, we always use a door panel, right? Right. But anyway, we'll see what we got and we'll find out and we'll pay attention to the rest of this video. Little red rocking chair. It's cracked them, but it'll still get a few bucks. A baseball bat, looks like it's been used, um, but not on baseball. Let's find out what else we got here. Oh, also in here, there's a porcelain items. Most of this is just no sales. Okay, folks, we're inside the locker room. See, that, that's pretty new. That, that might be a sell of something, sell of something else. So this, as I said, we got trash here, but we have a lot of things hidden here. Possibly. We'll see. It's all this, the goodies, it's under the umbrella of a... So let's, uh, let's, we'll look at things a little later and see how good we do. And there's a, a closer look on that's a little, the little barbecue pit there. So that's just all sort of good. Let's go find some more treasure. Yes. This particular item looks like it, it might fit, good, do good in my store. I can put the action figure things behind that glass. I'm going to take that with me. What do you think? Good idea. Well, I sit here in my easy chair looking at the review of the footage. And that was a good auction that you just saw. <clears throat> and we're able to return. Uh, we're go we're going to come out really ahead on a $5 locker. But they're not all winners. Take a look at this footage and you'll see what I got. And this one was a terrible loss. So take a look at this one and you'll see what I mean. Okay, here you're looking at a $5 locker. I got this one. I sold the idea there was no drawers there, and there might not be. Although I do see one, two of them. Hopefully the third one here. It's paid $5 for this. Got to burn that. Burn, burn, burn. Stand. Maybe, hopefully the fan works. Anyway, the fan and the fruit. And I got emergency food rationing. Oh boy. And macaroni. The last locker of the day. Thank you, Steve. He let me have it. And boy, did he let me have it. Uh, the other locker, which we did so good, uh, one of the, uh, the person, Steve, who always is there, he usually buys all the good lockers. He buys all the bad ones. Um, he wasn't there, so uh, myself, John, and the other fellow was able to get a locker for real reasonable and everything. Probably... Would have spent two or three hundred dollars more easy. Probably wouldn't have got the one that I got. John may not have got the one he got. But uh, that's what we got. <laughs> if that makes a lot of sense. And now let's take a look at some of the footage. That we like to use this footage here of some of the people we want to thank who purchased items for us. So we always appreciate our customers. Now in this business, there's always 
opportunities to screw up, make mistakes. Uh, I certainly take advantage of that, <laughs> but not to my good. I wanted to share something with you that I think will be helpful to you. I just want to show you what happened here. I had, I sold four of these and I had five to begin with. And what I did was I sold them all to the same person. They made four different orders. Now, sometimes what you can do is you could contact them and just say, let me relist it all together as a bundle and save you some shipping. Or you could just send them individually because sometimes people want things a certain way. What's the advantage of sending them out like this? Well, the advantage is, is they're obviously, and each one's insured. That's one thing. If it gets lost, you're, you're covered, number one, as opposed to the whole thing. Probably would be covered on the other one, too. But here's the deal. What happens sometimes, you have to make sure when you're looking at your app, and you're looking at the print, pay attention to the number right down there on the shipping and everything. Because the reason is very simple is this shipping number is for this package. This shipping number is for this package. What happens sometimes to me is it's the same label, printed up twice, but with the same number, 91. So what happens when it runs with the machine, all of a sudden, I don't know what's gonna happen other than the fact that they're gonna say that other one never got shipped and they'll get two of them with one shipping. I'm not sure if they'll get charged twice or whatever the ramifications are, but it does cause a problem. But if you pay close attention, now I had to went ahead and I, as I said, I had five, but I sold four, and I, I kind of figured, how did I end up with one left extra? Turned out this is a 1980. Those are all those were 70, but I had to reopen two when I had to do a little detective work, you might say, to figure out which number am I missing, and I found it. It was number 38 down there in the bottom because I actually had two 91s, if that makes any sense. What I'm trying to say is is uh, sometimes when you do these things, you got to pay attention to detail. Otherwise, you're going to get burned on, on shipping and packaging and everything like that. Um, just another tip to help you and help you in your, your shipping with your online business. It's been a busy week, but we got two more. We got Carla. Carla got the Raisin King black shirt, for size 42-44. So that's yours. Going out today, Carla. And our number two person is Sheena. This, this is a, a shake and go car. But when you touch it, it makes noise too. So, don't be alarmed. It's supposed to do that. Gets good gas mileage, too. Thank you for the order. On the wrong block. Go ahead and tell me. You can tell me. I'm a doctor. Well, I've got a bit of a dilemma. Uh, what's, yeah, well, you know, you got something to help you with that. Keep you out of the restroom. No, no, <laughs> dilemma, not diarrhea. Oh, well, okay, yeah. That's two different things. Oh. Well, are you sure? <laughs> well, I think so. Okay, well, what's your di uh, d dilemma? Well, see this comic book? I had this bought by two people. Uh-oh. Who bought the first one? David. Who bought the second one? David. Two Davids? I think it's the same one. But I kind of have to pick which way should I send it to? Well, you know how I make decisions like that? I give it a lot of thought, and then I ponder on it, and then I flip a coin. <laughs> okay, well, in that case, I'll go ahead and send it to David. Good decision. Anyway, Spider-Man and the Human Torch. That is a Marvel team-up. Kind of like you and I. We could call a team-up. Yeah, I don't think we're Marvel. We're Marvelous, are we? I don't I think we're better than Oracle. I don't know if you think so, yeah. Of course, then again, you you would do it. You would look better than an ask. Thank you. 
you know, too bad your brother's not here. He'd 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 debate that. He thinks he's better than Mess. Well, he does too. So, but anyway, we gotta go. Thank you, David. Well, we lost our power, and I don't know why. So Le uh, uh, Leon wasn't able to finish everything. He did finish his dialogue, but he left and everything. So there was a few of them that he missed. He fr he missed Mr. McMahon here, and I'm not sure who else he missed. I think the last one he did was Alberto Rio, but these are some more others. There's John Cena, The Big Show, and I might have showed the, you might have seen these already, and Brock Lesnar. Um, don't know who that is, but I think it's I think it's John Cena with, with, with as a zombie or something. I don't know, but anyway, this is just the abbreviated version of it. Just going to show you real quick, so in case I missed any, I won't miss any. So I, I'm just going to go real quick because obviously we're going to have a reiteration. Here's a young lady here, only girl, John Cena, of course, two shows on Michaels. Zombie Reigns. There's a big pile of them. There's another John Cena. They're, like they're piling up here, folks. Daniel Bryan. you got to come and get them. There they are. Uh oh There's Gina and Bruce. Anyway, that's, that's enough. There's still more, but we got to go. Bye-bye. Well, we got a box that we're going to go ahead and open up here. Uh, we opened up one just earlier with Leo the Lion. He was... Um, we're not going to have him back. He just he just takes too long, and you just don't know about his information. We're just going to show you the new wrestlers that we got and see what you think. Okay, we got a new John Cena. That's one. I think that's Randy Orton. Look at, look, I was going to say, look at his back, but he's, he's trying to be acrobatic. Anyway, that's what it looks like. Oh, now he's sticking out his foot. Anyway, he's a character. We'll put him over there. And Oh, yeah, look at him. This guy's good. He's good to go. He's a lot, got a lot of gestures. I think that's... Uh, I don't know who that is. I can't remember. This is... You know who this is. The Rock says... The Rock says he's always been... So we've got something to say. He said, if you smell what he's cooking. I didn't know he cooked. Here's another wrestler. It's M.I.X. He looks grumpy looking. But anyway... I can't remember his name. Uh, again, I'm not sure who that is. Oh, yeah. This is The Rock with a wonderful jacket. In the earlier days, before you got to be real, real popular. I don't know who this is. Daniel Bryan. Oh, yeah, the Macho Man, Randy Savage. This is something else. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Must have probably filmed there by accident. And there's Hulk Hogan. This is the one that, this is the reason why I went after this package, because of him. I see what this is. Got a garbage can here. And a vest for somebody. We'll find out who that's for later on. Got the fat boy, the big boy, Yokozuma. I don't know who that is. I think that's a manager. I can't remember his name. Har it's not Harvey Wilson. But he's Harvey Wilson, somebody else. Anyway, here's... I'm not sure that's a commentator. This one is King... Oh, well, this must be... Uh, you know who this is? It says King H.H. H. King F.H. H. I think this is Jerry Lawler. Hmm. I don't have very many. That's the first Jerry Lawler I think I've ever had. Oh, yeah. And you know who is. Okay, we had a busy weekend. And uh, I, I'm just, I, I got a, <laughs> I got a new location at the flea market. And it was something that it was, I didn't want to do it. But it's, I'm just, just too old packing something up. Then unpack it and then pack it back up and bring it back home and it's just it killing me. So anyway, I'm, I went back to the lockdown uh, store and I'm going to be there. That's it. But anyway, I want to thank some of our customers who bought some things. Serge, Sergio, Sergio of Jacksonville, Florida. Got the fantastic four Sioux issue. So congratulations for that. 
that's going out today. And we also have, um, uh, oh yeah, Kristen of Wound Woke, Wisconsin. No surprise here. She's a Milwaukee Brewer fan. She's got the little famous bullpen replica car. She's going to enjoy that. Uh, I have a lot of respect and appreciation for baseball fans, which I am one. And then we also want to thank Jessica. Jessica in Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. She got the minty, fresh Funko Pop. And it says it actually smells like mint. Of course, I can't. It does smell like mint. But anyway, I, I normally can't smell very good. I've spent too many years working with chemicals. Thank you for your order, folks. It's going to go out tomorrow. And there it is. Going out to you. Eduardo from Huntington, New York. Congratulations. May the sword be with you. Actually, it will be with you. <laughs> Look up in the sky. This is some of the modern day Superman. But when I was a kid, this was Superman. And congratulations to you. It's going out to Las Cruces, New Mexico. Good for you, Karen. You get to have the original Superman, but the uh, the new one is still there too. The old one is still right there. So that's I mean that's the new one. And we you got the old one. Second season. Congratulations. You really don't have to do this. You can stay here with me. You can stay here with me. What are you talking about, guy? Oh, this is Stacy Ray. You can you can stay here with me. I don't think so. He's right. You're going to stay here with me? He's not going to stay here with you. Please say you're going to stay here with me. He's not going to stay here with you. He's going to see Leah. Leah in North Carolina has just bought Stevie Ray. And Stevie Ray is thrilled. Oh. If you change your mind, you got a place for me. Leah. You can send him back to me. I like him. He's a good wrestler. He's a good guy. Tells jokes and everything. Okay, how would you know? You, you, he tells you jokes? Uh, I hear somebody tells you jokes. It's, it's all I, thought, I hear it on my head all the time. <laughs> uh, well, I, you, I, think you're, I think your uncle, Dr. Goody, is calling you. Yeah, I gotta go see him. Top to bottom, our store. Could you not find anything better here? Uh, not fun. Thanks for watching.